Here we have log base 3 of x plus log base 3 of x plus 6 equals 3. And this is a very standard exam level question right here, right? Because it combines all the things we've been working on. So let's do it, all right? First thing we do, always combine first. Combine first, right? That's the first step in all these log solve solving log equations problems that have a plus and, and two different logs, you combine them into a single one. All right, we use the properties of logarithms. That gives us log base three of x, x plus six equals three, All right? Cool. Next, we convert this to exponential form, All right? So our base stays the base to the power of three, right? Back around for the equals. Okay, so that gives us 3 to the power of 3, back around for the equals, x, x plus 6. This is actually a quadratic, though it doesn't look like it, but note here we have an x squared. And remember that x squared likes to be set equal to 0. You may probably have a bunch of other stuff in between here, but if you have an x squared on one side, it's really good to have zero on the other side. So let's see if we can make that happen here. Three cubed is 27, so we have 27 equals x squared plus six x. And now we can see how we can set that equal to zero by subtracting 27. Zero equals x squared plus six x minus 27. Okay, so let's factor this. Sometimes you can factor, sometimes you have to resort to the quadratic formula here. Hopefully we can get this to factor. Let's see. Uh, we need factors of, of c that add up to b. So factors of negative 27 that add up to 6. How about 3, uh, let's make that plus 9 minus 3. Give that a quick mental foil. Note that we do indeed get this trinomial back. Okay, so then we can solve it out. Set each one of these equal to 0. x equals negative 9 x equals 3. Okay, before we box these answers and call it a day, you want to check each one of them to make sure they don't give us a negative inside the log. Well look, I'm looking at x equals minus 9. On both of these, if we put in a minus 9 here, it'll give us a negative inside of a log. But you can't have a negative inside the log. It's not the domain of log. Right, so out this one goes. Cannot have that as a solution. Note that positive 3 is okay in both of these logs, so this one is okay. Doesn't make any of them negative on the inside, so there we go, x equals 3.